So what's going on guys? It's uh, Monday morning. It's about 30, 35 degrees, 2 o'clock. Uh, got a bunch of freezing rain and crap this weekend. If you can see in those woods, all that white stuff right here, that's all frozen. It's, um, and you can look like right there, that little guy's bent over. So everything's pretty well iced over. Everything's hanging low. Uh, we lost power here for a little bit, but, um, but yeah, so we didn't really get a whole lot. A little bit of snow, but mostly just freezing rain and ice. Not too slippery. We're supposed to get some more, I think, tonight or tomorrow morning. Uh, yeah, tonight or Wednesday morning. I'm not sure. Um, but I know they canceled a couple of schools. Um, but, so, back, uh, made the video, <clears throat> the, uh, scrap, um, what's it weigh? Um, and what that... What it was, was, um, it weighed 2,560 pounds, there's the note, uh, 2,560 pounds, that's what I made off of it, <clears throat> just steel, <clears throat> and, um, so the one, closest one to that was, uh, John Deere 50D, so, uh, shout out to you, man, um, he guessed 2,500, um, so, yeah, he was closest um, that was probably the last of the scrap metal we were taking out of that one building that I've been working on for a while. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I've been doing a whole lot. I'm driving my mom's Cadillac. Uh, put new spark plugs in it this weekend. They were, they had the white, they were all white around the tips. Um, I don't know what you call that, but they were bad. So we put six new ones in there. Uh, I actually got it down to a science now, so it doesn't take too, too long. Um, like, literally, we replaced them, like, 20,000 miles ago. I think it's running too rich or pushing too much oil into the engine. It leaks oil like a, um, like a subtle gun, but, you know, that is what it is, so. It's a little cold out. <clears throat> um, so, um, yeah, what else we do this weekend? Um, fix toilet, uh. The seal, the actual bolt, had come out of the ring that holds it to the floor. <clears throat> and it actually broke that white seal if you've ever taken apart a toilet. And, it, you know, it comes up and it has that ring. And you slide the bolts in and slide it up through your toilet. And then with your wax, wax ring, um, this one had actually broken the little plastic piece over the years, I think. Um, so, uh... I was told if I could do it cheaply to do it, it's not my house. But um, so the other side, I put a bolt and a washer down through it so it wouldn't pull up through, and then held it with a pair of ice scoops and tightened it down best I could. And I couldn't get the other one to hold because it was broken, so it kept popping out. So I just got pissed off eventually and went and got a lag screw that was about that big and just drilled that bitch right into the floor. Um, so now it's pretty stable. So. You can have no problem with that. Um, what else? Not a whole lot. So let's go up to Maryland yesterday, but we didn't, you know, because all this, and they got a bunch up there. Um, so, hey yeah, guys, I think that's about it. Um, not doing a whole, whole lot this week. Um, it's supposed to be nasty till Wednesday. Um, so, yeah, I uh, got some more lights for my truck. I um, actually got uh, 16 more of those little LEDs. Um, so, a bunch of them are going running boards, you know, right under the door flange. There's a little lip right there. They're going to go under there. There's four on each side. Uh, I'm going to put three in the grill to kind of replicate the Raptor look. Um, <clears throat> so, and then about, and then five down on the front of the uh, bumper on that, on that plastic um, flange or whatever they want to call it. But five, one one on each corner and then three kind of split in the middle um and then eventually I want to put some roof lights on it but that's that's a job to do probably when it's nice nice weather because you gotta drill one inch holes through the roof you gotta drill five holes it, it's gonna be a pain in the ass you gotta take down this and this and so you gotta run them all down and here and then there's a or your switches, there's a control level right there. It's 
so that's a job for another day. I can get the kit for like 50 bucks, but, um, but yeah, I also had to get a new battery in the truck, cold weather, it just kind of, it wasn't holding the charge very well, so I was trying to put it off as long as I could, but it just kept getting colder and colder and didn't want to start right away, so I figured do it now before I got to do it later. So, um, yeah guys, that's about it, so, um, but yeah, shout out John New 50 d um, so we'll probably, we'll try to make some more contest videos, um, but, uh, yeah, guys, y'all have a good one, and, uh, talk to y'all later.